Wow, major threat to Bitcoin. Are your Bitcoin safe? See, 9 billion Bitcoins are about to be dumped, right? What is going on here? So you remember a few years ago, like eight years ago, the largest exchange in the world for crypto, right, Mt. Gox actually got hacked. And there were so many Bitcoins that got hacked, but eventually they got most of it back, right? And now those Bitcoins are worth $9 billion and they need to be returned to all the original holders who lost all those Bitcoins, right? But guess what? After eight years, by forcing them not to sell because they've been hacked, now those coins have gone up so many, like a thousand X's. A lot of those people bought it eight to 10 years ago at around $250 per Bitcoin. Now it's close to $70,000 right, per Bitcoin. And of course, it went below 68K because the market realized suddenly there's going to be $9 billion of selling pressure that's coming. Now, not all of those people are gonna sell, but think about this. If you have been going to courts, battling, you know, Mt. Gox battling, the, the, you know, doing the legal battle for something you bought at $250, that's now worth $68,000. If you bought like, say, $1,000 worth of Bitcoin back then, it would be about $280,000 now. A lot of those people are just gonna take part of it and sell, but, is now the time to panic? Not at all, not according to me. I think this is another chance to dollar cost average in. In fact, this is actually quite bullish. Remember how I've been telling you guys that, you know, Biden and Trump are now in a race to be to see who is more crypto so they can win the crucial votes, the swing votes to decide this election. And recently, as I predicted, the Democrats have made a full pivot, a full pivot towards a pro crypto position. Look at this. They're now sending out, right? They're campaign staff to be reaching out to the crypto industry, the, the main players in the past two weeks for guidance on crypto community and policy, right? So they're fully pivoting as well, even though they're not announcing it or making big speeches. Both parties are now pro-crypto. Trump's pro-crypto, Biden's pro-crypto, and BlackRock's pro-crypto. What more do you need? So this, if they sell those $9 billion of Bitcoin, whatever. Yes, Bitcoin will go down some, maybe low 60s, maybe mid 60s, but that's another chance to get into some of the your favorite altcoins, another chance. Yes, it is an election year, but however, we do need to keep in mind of the recession situation, as I warned you guys a few months ago. See, every time when this line turns up, right, we have a recession, like 89, 2000 crash, right? 2008 crash, right? And now we're getting that signal almost again. So that's the only thing to watch out for. Other than that, the market is looking relatively bullish right now. A pullback is another chance to dollar cost averaging, in my opinion. Not financial advice, follow me.